Open a new graphing window. Define linear function f1 in terms of a variable. Press Enter to graph it. Now define logarithmic function f2 in terms of f1. Press Enter to graph it. Notice that the graph of f2 is the graph of a logarithmic function of base 10. Define function f3 in terms of f1 so that it results in a logarithmic function of base e. Define function f4 in terms of f1 so that it results in a logarithmic function of base 5 with a horizontal shift. Change function f1 and see how the corresponding functions change while they maintain their relative distance from f1.